Hello, welcome to Game Rating Review. I'm wearing a plaid shirt, so that means today is a Let's Play. Today I'm playing the tank simulator, Dead Secret, and the character moves very slow, but hopefully we'll get through it. So let's do it. Okay, let's try this again. Bottom, top, left. Wow, ooh, monkey mask. And this will fit into the mask's eye sockets. It's like the weird part of the goggles. Okay. Oof. That's something else. Whoa. Okay. Oh, there's some demon guy there. And he disappeared. And there's something. Whoa, who is that? Ooh, a guy with a demon mask. Okay, let's see here. More to this painting. All right. There was a page taped to that. Of course, something else I need to read. Oh, reading words is hard. No, it's not. Go to school. Learn to read. Don't be stupid. If you're reading this note, then something must have happened to me. I may be dead or missing. If so, you're the only person who can save our research. The truth is that I'm being threatened. I started, it started before I left college. I get notes every few months from somebody calling himself Woodcutter. What he wants is access to our research. He wants me to turn over the plans to the Lunar Dream Apparatus. The Lunar Dream Apparatus. Josie, my life, <laughs> Josie, my life is in danger. Woodcutter knows things, secret things about my past that nobody should know. I'll not yield to simple blackmail, but lately the threats have escalated. I'm sure that I'm being watched in the house, and sometimes I hear things on the other side of the wall. Yesterday, with a mask on, I thought I saw somebody reaching for me. It's a warning from my subconscious. I'm no longer safe here. I've locked the research away in the safe upstairs. I want you to retrieve it and leave. Destroy everything before you go. Burn the house down if you have to. Just get the research, get out of here, and head for the big city. Who calls any city the big city? I'm counting on you, Joe. Don't let your work fall into their pants. I mean, I guess they're out in the country, but I never... I'm kind of from the country. I kind of... I am, actually. Oh, how much billiard? Which are primary suspect. Ordered by you to destroy their research and split. Hmm. Big city? Come on now. Hmm. I wonder if I could just put the mask on whenever I want. Um, who is what you open the safe upstairs? Okay, just looking around the room. Okay, well, let's walk back over here because you know, maybe it'll let me through that one door because maybe that's the upstairs. Harris' body was found by... Oh, now they're... Okay. I'm pretty sure it's Bobby Soar. That's it. Okay. Bobby ran out of jobs billiards. He certainly had the opportunity. But you were scared. He worried about losing... Secret... Yeah. I... Yeah, That. that's it. Okay. Blackmail. Okay, yeah. Kill for it. Okay. Billiard was being blackmailed by... Hmm. Woodcutter. Yeah. That's it. Woodcutter. Yeah, I mean... Uh, all right, okay. Do you sell the story? I need some raw evidence. Let's go check out that safe upstairs. Okay. I want to know what happens when I put the mask on and look in the mirror. I want to know what happens. I think something weird is going to happen. Okay. Nothing? Nothing happens when I look into the mirror? Man. You should have, like, went to a vortex or something. Okay, so this has to be the upstairs. Yeah. Alright. Uh-oh. Scary upstairs. The scariest part is how long it's going to take me to get up these stairs. Okay. I mean... Still, still going up these stairs. 
Music is pretty creepy. I like how claustrophobic this is. Left to right. If I was going by this picture, I would actually go right, but my instinct is telling me to go left. I would only gotta go by the picture to go right. Let me see if the mask tells me. The mask tells me nothing. I'm gonna go left. Why not? I mean, what's gonna happen? Death? I doubt it. Look, there's a chest there. <laughs> Okay, first off, let's see what's in this cupboard. Well, it's, it's a wardrobe, actually. You know. There's absolutely nothing in here. You have this huge wardrobe, and there's nothing in it. Wow. Pretty comfortable, but I don't have time to rest. Okay. It says, helicopter may win... Oh, Vietnam War. Okay, that's 65, World War II. Destroyed, thrown and killed 75 Japanese in Iwo Jima. He is the only Medal of Honor winner currently serving in Vietnam. The most effective weapon the Viet Cong is used is terror. Okay, so not super PC, I guess. Yeah, people really like hiding letters and other stuff. Let's see. What do we have here? Another letter for me to read. And it's a diary entry. Today is an anniversary. It was five years ago today that I found Dad's name on an old research paper at UOC. He had written in 1933, eight years before I was born. I didn't know how I'd gone to college, and I never really thought about his life. He was just the name of my birth certificate. Dad ran out on mommy after the war. He had gone off to fight, just never came back. When she stopped writing, mama thought he'd been killed. I remember her crying at the kitchen table. The war ended, life went on, mama, mama died without ever finding out what happened to him. I used to hate him. I hated the idea of him. I hated my mother a little bit too. I figured dad was just a deadbeat who ditched mama because he didn't want a kid. But when I found his name in the library, something changed. I couldn't stop thinking about him. Deadbeat dad, dads don't study physics, do they? What is he doing now? What does he look like? Is he married to someone else? I traced him here to Kansas, but finding him is taking longer than expected. Came to Kansas to look for her father. Oh, so maybe her father is like the dead guy or something? Possibly? Oh, man. It just takes you so long to do everything. I have found something. Bobby, here is your latest chapter all, all tied up. I think this story is becoming very interesting, and I'm sure you can get it published. I hope you don't mind, but I made a few edits and inserted a few details here and there. Looking forward to your next chapter, Joe. Crystal Cave. I'm not going to... When they found him, he had crawled halfway. Poor stuff. Blah, 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 blah. The man was inked. Inked where the lines were. lines wearing. Jimmy. And chain. Detective. Wait, what was that? <laughs> Detective Henderson thought he was smart as a whip. He had photos taken of the body, all naked and everything. On his wall, um, leave it with a map on the corner. Clients didn't just say mat. When they saw into the man's bone, they found a map there too. A narrow stump. Well, that's how we first found our way to the cave. A sparing fiction ride. Helping Botter on its writing. Okay, that's, that's something. Yet again. Like Gone Home, there's somebody who's a writer, um, which I guess is fine. Yet again, birds out of the window. That looks like a crazy lock on that thing. Like a just crazy go nuts. Oh, look, all this is open over there. <gasps> a handprint. It might say reporter on my desk, but I spend most of my time at the standard making coffee for my editor. I'm tired of writing the gossip column. This story is my shot at the big leagues. When I prove that Bullard was murdered, all the big papers will come calling. I'll finally escape this backwater town. This is it, the chance I've been waiting for. Oh, uh, cool. 
Okay, what did I have to do in a hand for it? What? Let's see if I can see anything of a monkey mask. Hmm. Notice that there before. There's a small dial mounted on there. Okay. Okay, well, let's go. Go to the other room. Maybe they have the key in there or whatever. Just gracious. There's got to be like a run button or something. Okay. And I kind of get what they're trying to do. Like being slow and methodical is going to make something or something or other. Thing. This is a much bigger room. I'm falling down. I'm like coming through there. Even more notes under beds. Ooh, a little puzzle here. Why it's put together. Let's see, yoink, um, yoink, oh come on, um, I want a photo of two men on a ship, yoink. I guess I just taped it together. James Larry and Harris Bull. Hmm. Oh, well, there's the actual safe. Huh. Harris Biller, I'm Woodcutter. I know your secret. James Larry sends his regards. Character is my promise. He went south. There. Hopefully, I can grab it from this angle. I'm gonna walk over to the window, maybe. Okay, it's a better angle. There we go. In the log, November 2nd. We did a test run in the uh, ID focal lens today. At first, we did not know how to interpret the results, but I believe they are working better than anticipated. Instead of unfiltered stream of sensor information, what we are seeing is in subconscious memory, the lens distorts response of visual stimuli that the wearer has some knowledge of. They see what my conscious mind cannot. And Josie proposed what we are really doing is mining dreams, dreams that after all form. ID focus, subconscious from truth. As a control mnemonic, the mask works pretty well. I could tell that Josie was dubious at first, but now she understands subconscious thought is potentially dangerous to the subject. We need a physical object to enable the mind to compartmentalize, providing the wearer with some degree of cognitive protection. A permanent augmentation will require a much larger apparatus. We will need some other kind of focus. Okay, information will receive something larger and ubiquitous. The moon, perhaps. Dream thought? The moon? Am I right? Okay, how am I going to get this thing open? Yeah, no kidding. Find the safe combination. Well, no kidding, find the safe combination. drawer over here. Table. Ooh, a hand print. Maybe that'll go into my past or something. Okay. Bill told me to cover Bullard's death, but he's just looking for gossip about the young assistant. But I took it seriously, did the research, followed every lead like a real journalist would. 
It paid off. I found something everybody else missed. A note, a half thought, scribbled in the margins of the coroner's draft report. It read, hypothermia in summer. Oh, that's kind of weird. Other than like the voice acting not being top notch. I mean, that's kind of weird. Which the mask. Oh, there you are. Oh, and my screen went weird. Uh, how's it going up there, buddy? Oh. I wonder what happens if I go over there. Right on top of him. It's a plate with a circular dial. Ooh, I know where that goes. Yeah, I got the circular dial. Cool. Okay, where's my mask? Is he gone? No, he's still there. Hey, buddy, just hanging out up there? Just kind of... Just kind of sitting against the wall? Your, your head's on backwards and stuff. Okay, I just, uh, just wanted you to know that. Am I supposed to look in the fireplace? Okay, buddy. Well, you know. full of logs. Doesn't really help me. Okay, let me look at him from this angle. Hey buddy, how's it going? Doing okay? Are you coming at me? Or are you just gonna... Alright, cool man, whatever. Well, see you later. You know, I know you're there, so, you know. Uh, yeah, take it easy and stuff. You know, maybe see a chiropractor about the neck and stuff. You know, stuff like that. Hmm, I wonder what creepy thing will be. Looking down the stairs without me. No. See, that'd be creepy if this door opened, like, slowly, and then something started crawling at me and I had to run away. That would be some scary stuff right there. Yeah. Look at this door. Hmm. Okay, let's open this door. We're going to go put the circular thing on the other thing. We're going to figure out what's going on. And... Okay, let's keep going. Okay, let's get to the safe. Any minute now, I'm gonna get to that safe. Okay, I'm here. All right. Okay, what am I gonna do first? Well, let me press on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Get my circular object. Put it against here. All right. All right, I love these. About right. Yeah, that's about right. No, no. Is that not right? Let's try the other way then. Oh, I get it. Oh, I got you. It has to be all upright and stuff. Boom. Upright and stuff. Ooh, so many things. It's a small wooden knob. Where does that knob go? There was something that I couldn't open. I think it was in downstairs. Small wooden knob. Okay. It's like Josie's stuff. Linens and books. Okay, dear diary. Todd Bowyer and I build a chassis for his new weather device. He's a weird as usual, but I don't get why we're building it. But Billiard doesn't explain things. Tomorrow I need to go buy some ballast for the base. Today was Mama's birthday. She would have been 54. I bet she would have liked the work doing now. I hope she's proud. I've been over a year since I had it last. But it never changes. I've written about it over and over, but the writing seems to help. I'll tell you about it again. I'm five years old. Our apartment in Chicago is dark. I've gotten out of bed, got some water, and here's something coming from Mama's room. You can see a tall man standing over her. He has his hand around her neck. He's breathing hard, and in the cold night air, I can see his breath. It streams out of his mouth like over it, and there isn't any breath coming from Mama's. She's already dead, but he continues to squeeze. When I was a kid, I thought the dream would go away. When I grew up, it hasn't. The recurring dream is about her mother's death. Rats, the safe combination isn't here. I'm pretty sure I saw the drawer with the missing knob. Downstairs, though. Okay. Okay, well. Uh-oh. Well, let's go downstairs and then 
probably in the drawers the combination of the safe and then um, you know this the safe has like a has like something in it and then I'm probably gonna figure it out what's going on here this walk speed oh shit I was right holy fuck holy fucking shit I was right wow that's really scary um, In a chair? Really? This is where I'm hiding? I can't change. Ending D, which probably means dead. Ending C, which probably means you suck. Well, I get to see an ending, um, the dead ending. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to play this some more. Um, but yeah, uh, it's interesting. Um, it's an interesting game. Um, I kind of like how I kind of was getting it towards the end, especially with. You know, the monster, me predicting the monster was going to come up the stairs, and that was cool. Uh, so, yeah, uh, thank you for watching Game Ray Review Let's Play. Uh, Dead, this was Dead Secret. Um, please hit that like and subscribe button, that'd be cool. And uh, thank you for watching, and thank you for watching me play YouTube and stuff.